BK from Amberwars.com promoting play patriotism here at Dundas Square, downtown Toronto, Canada. And it is currently 5.43 p.m. Happy Easter Sunday, April 12th. Play my deck, the New World Order song. It is treason to not let Canadians act polite anymore. It's like every time you saw a Japanese person speak Japanese, you go, no, don't do that, don't do that. Don't, no, no, not allowed, no, forget it, no, no, no. Destroying the culture, destroying the people, destroying what took them thousands of years to build, or to not let Canadians be polite anymore. Not let them respect each other and teach kids to and communicate well. Always have to act like rude, sketchy, lying, un-Canadian trash. That is treason against the country of Canada. You're not killing one person, you're killing 37 million. National insecurity issue. Need national security strategy 2020 to beat it. This is a national security issue. Should be a national insecurity issue. It's treason for this garbage to make everyone it knows uncomfortable, so they don't want to pay attention to it, and this garbage to wander around near strangers, bothering them with shit this garbage knows no one likes. That is treason. Here, Young and Dundas, quarter to six, Sunday, April 12th, 2020. That is treason. That's treason. Imagine if you go to Italy and someone's trying to speak Italian. You go, no, don't do that. No, don't do that. Don't speak Italian. Don't act Italian. Don't do anything. Imagine if you're in Canada and someone's polite. Hey, nice, polite. Minding my business. Hey, nice to people. Looking at talking to people. No, no, not allowed to do that. Rude, sketchy, lying, un-Canadian trash. Wanders around. Bothering strangers. After pissing off people we know who don't want to pay attention to us anymore. That is treason. Unless you're seriously mentally ill, it's treasonous. Either way, politely ignore it. Don't bother him back or anybody else. Nobody likes that. Everyone happier. But that is treason against the whole country. Fuck you. I can't get along with people. Bother you. That's treason. Can't be polite anymore here. Fuck that. That's treason. That's treason against the country of Canada. Against the people of Canada. It's destroying Canada. Destroying people in Canada. So we can't be polite anymore, so what are we? Fucking zombies? Fucking rude, sketchy zombies? What can zombies do with other zombies? Nothing. What do they do? They go attack nice people, try and make them zombies? What the fuck is that? This is treason. It doesn't care. It doesn't care. You try and mind your business near it. It'll bother you. You try and be nice to someone near it. It'll bother you. You try and look at or talk to someone. It'll bother you. Because it's rude, sketchy, lying, un-Canadian trash. Or mentally ill. Either way, politely ignore it. Don't bother it back or anybody else. Nobody likes that. It's treason to not let Canadians be polite anymore. Like every time you're in Italy and someone spoke Italian, you're like, nope, 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 nope. Hey, buona sera. Nope, 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 nope. No more speaking Italian. Fuck you. Sketchy. Bother you. No. No more. It's treason to do that in Canada with polite Canadians. Not let Canadians be polite anymore. No. Sketchy. Bother you. No. No. Hey, you're nice to that person. No. No. Bother you. Sketchy. Can bother you. Well, people I know don't want to look at this. I go for strangers to put up with it. Yeah. 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 That's treason. Treason. To not let Canadians be polite anymore. It's fucking treason. Road lying, sketchy, un-Canadian garbage. That people it knows don't want to look at it anymore, don't want to pay attention to it anymore, and then it goes near strangers and bothers them. Got to force them to put up with garbage it knows no one likes. That's treason. That's treason. That's subverting Canada. It's not letting people be cool anymore. Because this garbage has to get its rocks off, bothering people until you don't like it. And that's its life. Unless you're seriously mentally ill, fucking treason. Not to let Canadians be polite anymore. Not to let people be cool anymore. Not to people be nice anymore. Not to let teach kids how to be nice, polite Canadians who look at and talk to each other. But make them rude, lying, on Canadian trash that has to bother you while you're impotent. Grown ass man or woman can't say a fucking thing. This has to be a mess while you're a mess. Or a mess back and forth. Until you can't do it with each other, you'll mess with our fucking people. Fucking treason. 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 Do not let Canadians be polite anymore. Fucking treason, man. Ridiculous. See some nice person over there? Fuck you. Put up with me.
He's a nice person. Fuck you. Put up with me. Put up with your friends. I already did that. Now we can't stand each other. Now we go do it near strangers. That's treason. Unless you're seriously mentally ill. Fucking treason. Not let Canadians be polite. Nice to each other. Look at, talk to each other. Like you're in Japan. No more Japanese. Oh, how you doing? No, no. Spaz out. No, not allowed to anymore. No more, no more. Yeah, bowing. Nice. Lady, gentlemen. No, no, no more. No more. Destroy their fucking 5,000 year old culture. You'll destroy our fucking 200 year old culture that way. It's treason. Treason. Do not let Canadians be polite anymore. Canadians are polite. What are they? Fucking zombies? Rude, lying, sketchy, un Canadian trash? That nobody they know wants to pay attention to them? They go bother strangers and try and force them to put up with it? That's treason. As the tricker force you to see something you're not going to like. And then when you don't like it anymore, it goes and does it near strangers. That's treasonous, rude, lying, un-Canadian trash. Not my ugly ass wife or girlfriend freaking out on me in public. Oh, just an impotent, can't say or do anything. Everyone else is uncomfortable. It's treasonous garbage. And it's fucking treason to do that. Do I kill one person? Go to jail. Do I kill 37 million? That's treason. This is national insecurity. This garbage bothered everyone it knows. And now this garbage won't let anyone else be nice to each other. It wanders around bothering it, bothering them. That's treasonous garbage. Do not let Canadians be polite anymore. Well, you want to go to Japan? Hear people speak in Japanese? Go, no, no more, no more. You tell you hear Japanese, bother you, no more. Fuck that, no more, bother you, fuck, no. Shut up, no. no. That's treason against Japan. Destroying their culture. Destroying their people. Destroying their way of life. Fucking garbage. Bad enough. You want to fuck with people you know. You want to fuck up everybody near you. Make that your fucking life. Excuse me. So, anyway. Guys, cop, respect each other. You yell me. Respect each other. Well, no respect, no problem, no solution, nobody there. Best practices. Pass it on. This rude, lying, un-Canadian, treasonous trash will not let Canadians be polite anymore. That's treason. Won't let people it knows be polite, then it won't let strangers be polite. That's treason against the country and culture and people of Canada. That's treason. Want to kill one person, go to jail? Fine. Want to kill 37 million? Subvert them? Throw them under international bankster, communist conspiracy control? Destroy religion, family? Men and women, kids, being nice to each other. So we're all equal, equal serfs, a bunch of psychos with a bunch of useful idiots. That is treason. Garbage won't let people it know be nice, then garbage won't let strangers be nice. That is treason. <laughs> that is treason. This is rude, lying, treasonous, un Canadian trash. I won't let anyone be polite anymore. Not letting Canadians be polite anymore is treason. Not letting people you know be polite is treason. Not letting strangers be polite is treason. It's a national insecurity issue. This is a national security issue. This garbage pisses off everyone it knows while they're impotent, they can't say or do a fucking thing, they don't want to pay attention anymore, and this garbage goes and bothers strangers with the same shit. That is treason. Treason against the country and culture and people of Canada. Mm-hmm.
Go ahead. This garbage bothers everyone. Won't let anyone be nice to anyone. That's treasonous garbage. You help people stop or go to hell. Go ahead. You try and be busy. It'll bother you. Try and be nice. It'll bother you. Try and look at or talk to anyone. It'll bother you. See this garbage? See that garbage? That garbage goes near strangers when people it knows don't want to pay attention to that garbage anymore. That's treason. It's treason. This piece of shit is not my ugly ass wife or girlfriend freaking out in public while I'm impotent, can't say or do anything. It does that near everybody that you want to do anything with anymore, it does it near strangers. That's what that garbage does. Road lying un Canadian trash. That's what it is. It's garbage. It's garbage that won't let anyone be polite anymore. Won't let anyone be nice anymore. It looks for them to bother. And that is treason against the country, culture, and people of Canada. That is a subversive act. It's a national insecurity and a national security issue. It's like going to Japan, and every time someone speaks Japanese, you fucking bother them. So they can't speak Japanese anymore. It's like going to Italy. Every time someone speaks Italian or has a bite of spaghetti, you bother them. So they can't do it anymore. They can't enjoy it anymore. That is treason. That is treason. Canadians aren't polite. What are they, fucking zombies? We can't do anything with other zombies? And they wander around bothering polite Canadians to make more zombies? That is fucking treason. That's destroying, killing 37 million people. This is a national insecurity and national security issue. We need national security strategies to beat this treasonous shit. People can't get along with people they know, they won't let anyone else get along with each other. That's treason. Excuse me, sir. And then what? They're locked up, solitary, quarantined, can't say or do shit. Just torture each other in there, and they can't wait to run around and bother strangers. What is that shit? You're a young and queen. That is treason. That is rude, lying, un-Canadian, treasonous trash. It won't let anyone be nice to each other. It won't let anyone teach kids to be nice, polite Canadians. It will bother you, because it bothers strangers after pissing off everyone it knows. You help people stop, you go to hell. That simple. Because that's treason. You want to know what this place will look like in five years? Nothing. Garbage. With garbage bothering garbage, looking for more people to bother to turn into garbage. That is treason. That's what that is, sir. Sorry, brother. Good luck. Unless it's seriously mentally ill. Actually, even if it's mentally ill or not, quietly ignore it. You don't bother it back, you don't bother anybody else. No respect, no problem, no solution, nobody there. Best practices, pass it on. Unless you want to turn into garbage, no one wants to pay attention to you. You bother strangers and try and turn them into garbage too. It is treason to not let Canadians be polite anymore. Treason against the country, culture, and people of Canada. Do not let them be polite, teach kids to be polite, not let them be nice, act nice enough to look at and talk to each other comfortably. That is an act of treason. Well, you go to Japan, every time someone speaks Japanese, you bother them. No more Japanese anymore, buddy. That's fucking treason against their culture. Go to Italy. Yeah, speak Italy. You enjoy spaghetti. Hey, no way, bother you. No way you can do that. Come to Canada. Hey, I'm polite, nice getting along. Bother you, bother you, bother you, bother you. That's treason. Road lying, un-Canadian treason is trash. Unless you're seriously mentally ill. Either way, quietly ignore it. Help people stop. Or go to hell. Is anybody that could be nice, zombies are looking for. They're looking to make them zombies. That's what they do. That is treason. Bad enough, you won't let anybody you know be nice when you go bother strangers. They can't be nice, polite Canadians teaching kids to be either. That is treason against the country, culture, and people of Canada. It's treasonous to not let Canadians be polite. We're not polite, what are we, fucking zombies? Hey, don't wipe your face, fuck force you to put up with it, asshole. That you do every time someone can talk, they don't want to talk to you anymore. <clears throat> Three.
treason not to let Canadians be polite anymore. That is treason. I'll kill one person, go to jail, go ahead. You want to kill 37 million? That's treason. Treason. Not letting anyone you know be polite anymore and wander around, not letting strangers be polite anymore. That is treason against the country and culture and people of Canada. Uh, uh, it's okay. That is rude, lying, un-Canadian trash. That garbage forces everyone to put up with it acting sketchy until you don't want to pay attention anymore. Then it bothers strangers. It, it makes sure no one can be polite. That's garbage. That's treason. Force you to put up with shit you don't like. You're just impotent. You can't say or do nothing as a grown-ass man or woman. You're just a mess near it. You just mess with it back. When you can't do it with each other, you go mess with strangers. Excuse me. That is treason against the people, culture, and country of Canada. Sir. Won't let anybody be polite. Won't let teach kids to be polite. Bother anyone who's nice to anyone. That's treason. Treason against Canada. The people, the country, the culture. It's like going to Japan. Every time someone speaks Japanese, you fucking bother them. Well, they can't speak Japanese anymore. In Canada, you go to Canada, you bother them until they can't be polite anymore. That is treason. Treason. It is treason to not let Canadians be polite. To not let people you know be polite. And that when you can't pay attention to each other anymore, not let strangers be polite. That is treason. It's a major national insecurity and national security issue. Garbage just bothers people. You don't like it. And then you don't want to pay attention anymore. And then garbage just bothers other people trying to make them garbage. That's treason. That's rude, lying, un-Canadian treasonous trash. It won't let anyone be polite anymore. It won't let people it knows be polite. And then for fun, it wanders around bothering polite strangers. And it won't let them be polite. It's like going to Japan. Every time someone speaks Japanese, you bother them. No! No more Japanese! No! No more! Don't care what you've been doing for 5,000 years. Forget it! No more! Destroy it all! The international communist conspiracy. Useful idiot. Working for psychopathic central banksters. Want to kill, destroy everything that people like. Religion, family, men, women, kids, everything. Destroy everything. To make us all equal and under their control. All commie zombies. Can't respect anyone, no one respects us. Because once we destroy everything, that will all be equally poor under their control. That is treason. That is subversion. That is garbage. Don't think that's my ugly ass wife. That's everyone's ugly ass wife acting bitchy and sketchy. You don't want to pay attention anymore. And then it goes and does it near strangers. That is treason. That is treason. It will not let anybody be polite. It will not let any men, women, or children be polite. It will bother you if it sees it. That's what it's looking to do. That is treason. Unless it's seriously mentally ill, in which case, same thing. Politely ignore it. Don't bother it back or anyone else. Everyone happier. But that is treason. Not letting kids be polite anymore. Every time they try, you bother them until they can't. Until they turn to garbage, bothering more. This is a major national security and national insecurity issue. It'll force you to put up with it while you're impotent. Can't say or do shit as a grown-ass man or woman. Nothing. You don't want to pay attention anymore. It'll go do it near strangers. That is treason. Excuse me. That is treason against the country, culture, and people of Canada. Do not let Canadians be polite anymore. Just like if you're in Japan, People try speaking Japanese, you bother them until they can't speak Japanese anymore. Or Italy, they can't speak Italian, they can't enjoy spaghetti, whatever the hell they do. Today's polite. Or what, they're zombies? We can't do it with other zombies? And then attack polite Canadians to make more zombies? That is treason. This is a major national security and national insecurity issue that we have to deal with. To help people stop 
was garbage that turns into that just wanders around looking for more people to turn into garbage when they can't do anything with people they know because they're not polite Canadians. Yeah, this garbage, nobody wants to pay attention to this garbage. If they did, why would it bother strangers? Nobody at knows wants to pay attention to that garbage. If people at New wanted to pay attention to that garbage, it wouldn't bother strangers. Because it's just garbage. It's garbage bothering people. Rude, lying, un-Canadian, treasonous trash. They won't let anyone be polite. That's treason. That's treason in Canada. Not letting Canadians be polite. Not letting Italians speak Italian. Hey, bother you, no, no more of that. Fuck you. Whatever you people like, fuck that. No more. It's treason against the people and culture and country of Canada. And that's what it does all day and night when it can't do anything else near people. That is treason. You help people stop or go to hell. You don't really have a choice. Because they'll take you there. That's what they're looking for. You want this place to look like in five years? You won't be able to look at it. Your head will be down. Because of all the fucking sketchy zombies that want to force you to see them look ugly. Treason. Do not let Canadians be polite anymore. Hey, good point, buddy. Put up with this. Fuck you. Hey, put up with it. Yeah, whoever you are. Mind your business. Fuck you. Put up with this. Oh, well, you're nice, that person. Ah, put up with this. Put up with this. Go to Japan. Do that every time someone speaks Japanese. Throw you in jail. Treason against the Japanese people who want to be Japanese. Treason against polite Canadians who want to be polite. This garbage bothers everyone it knows because no one wants to look at it anymore. And this garbage bothers strangers who don't want to look at it. And it knows. That's why it has to bother you. People that know don't, people that know don't like that garbage. Otherwise they wouldn't be bothering strangers. That is treason. Unless you're seriously mentally ill. In which case, same thing. Politely ignore them. Don't bother them, anybody else. Let everybody else relax, feel better. Let them be, enjoy being ignored, want to stop. Yellow self-respect, don't be a mess. It's treason, not to let gays be polite. I see you getting along with somebody. Hey, put up with me, fuck you both. That's treason. Major national security issue. Major national insecurity issue. That's treason. Piss off everyone you know, then go piss off strangers. Make that your life. Treason, treason, treason. It's treason. It's treason. It's rude, lying, sketchy, un-Canadian, treasonous trash. Bothers everyone. Why to force everyone to see it look ugly. You're impotent while it pretends to be your ugly wife or girlfriend. It's a piece of shit that no one wants to pay attention to. Bothering strangers, try to turn them into pieces of shit. That is treason. Rude, lying, un-Canadian, treasonous trash. Oh, you, you go to Japan. Try and stop them from speaking Japanese. They'll throw your ass in jail. Fuck you. Every time I open my mouth and speak Japanese, ah, fuck you, put up with me. Not gonna like it. And then here in Canada, every time you be polite and nice to someone, ah, fuck you, put up with it. Ah, go, see those nice people? Go bother them. Yeah, yeah. See those people getting on? Go bother them. See that person smiling? Force you to see them look ugly. That's treason. Treason against the country, people, and culture of Canada.